Okay, this has been bugging me for the past like 48 hours. Does anybody remember the uh, Star Wars plug and play games from like 10 years ago? I'm going to pull it up and tell me if you remember or not. Let me make sure my. Um, now let's get the no commentary version. Let me make sure my audio is up here. Does anybody remember this? <laughs> this is such a throwback. Because I, this like, for whatever reason, I like remembered this the other day and I can't stop thinking about it. I guess a lot of people don't remember. Anybody remember this game? Bro, what the fuck is this? People are saying no. Never seen it. <laughs> so some, for a very limited amount of people, this is going to be very nostalgic. And for everybody else, it will be very confusing. This is like... Uh, Back in the day, they used to have these plug-and-play games where it was like just a controller. You would buy, I think it was like 30 bucks, and you would buy just a controller, and you literally, they gave you like a yellow and a white uh, input for your TV, audio and video. You plug it in, you play, plug-and-play. <laughs> they were the worst shitty games. T-dubs. So spoiling us with a bonus stream you shouldn't have. Yeah, but I and yet I am. And yet I am spoiling you. No group of Ninja Gini. These games are trash. Why is all the recommendations all of a sudden What is this now? Why is it recommended all like this now? There was also, and I don't know if you remember, this one is a little bit actually more nostalgic. The SpongeBob plug and play. Mad Mike says, thanks for the late night content. Yeah, you're welcome, buddy. The fuck? Here we go. Anybody remember this one? Hello, and welcome to a... Uh, no, uh, why is there commentary for this? Uh... <laughs> Does anybody remember this? <laughs> Probably not a lot of people are going to remember. So it's somewhat self-indulgent. It, it, uh, it looked like this. This is what it looked like. This was the console. And his nose was the joysticks. Anybody remember? <laughs> Some people are saying yes. <laughs> <laughs> Brock, Almeo. The sound effects were so fucking annoying, man. Imagine that for, like, hours. I don't know how I did that as a kid. I used to play this game for hours and hours. This isn't even, like, that old. This is from, like, the 2000s. People are saying, video games used to suck. This was made probably around the same time as... Like a lot of like modern games. I can hear you chewing, bro. Yeah, good, good zoomer clips. That's uh, I'm I'm that's my intention. Well, now I'm self-conscious about it actually. When was this from? What year, I wonder. Does it say?
what year it is? I don't think so. This was my personal favorite, was the uh, Patrick Maze game. <laughs> you would always do this. You were supposed to find Gary, and then Patrick would always do this goofy-ass dance. <laughs> <laughs> so funny when he gets hit by the jellyfish and he just falls on his ass. <laughs> like that. 15 bucks on eBay? Oh, maybe I'll cop. Maybe not. This doesn't actually look very fun to play. It's kind of a funny nostalgic thing. Nick not even playing games he used to play, watching YouTube clips of games he used to play. Well, yeah, because I don't have it, okay? Musical clams. The clams are feeling musical tonight. We've got a real comedian here. He's trying to sound like uh, the Spongebob narrator. <laughs> Alright, okay. That's enough of that. <laughs> that was probably enough of that a long time ago. <laughs> 